Good evening and welcome to ATV News. My name is Shella Malawson. On tonight's bulletin, our pundit is here to give his analysis of the soccer final. An artist spreads the AIDS message. A dancing group complains about promoters and a group of high school musicians are set to release their own album. Spain were crowned champions of Europe last night after thrashing Italy 4-0. Our soccer expert Jason Gallagher is here to give us his reaction. What a tournament this has been and what deserved winners we have in Spain. I'll be honest and say I wanted Italy to win because of their brave performances so far in this championship but Spain have proved to us all why they are world champions. The influence of Andre Iniesta should not be overlooked here. He was crucial to them not only winning but also banishing the boring tag they received, rightly in my opinion. Once Italy went 1-0 down there wasn't much they could do. The last time a team beat Spain after going a goal down were Northern Ireland as far back as 2006 when Dave Vahili got a sensational hat-trick. The enigma that is Mario Balotelli was a ghost of his former self, rarely posing a threat. Maybe a man with more character might not have looked so defeated when going a goal behind. Overall though, Italy can look at themselves with pride. None of us expected them to go this far due to their woeful World Cup display, but they deserve to get the runners-up medal after beating tough opposition in the form of England and Germany en route to the final. If you want to continue the soccer debate, log on to our Facebook page to share your views on the tournament. With over one million people living with HIV in Zimbabwe, a Bulawayo artist is now raising awareness about the dreaded disease through art. Selim Klanga gives us the story. In a departure from the traditional methods of spreading HIV and AIDS messages, a Bulawayo artist, Bekinchen Charlie, is now raising public awareness about the disease through art. Bekinchen Charlie spoke to ATV about his artwork and its meaning in the fight against AIDS. What inspires me actually is the day-to-day -day life and the experiences, our experiences and surrounding people. He said he was motivated to do a painting on HIV and AIDS after visiting a nightclub and a counseling and testing center. It's time to choose now because we've already heard about, this talks about the, this pandemic or HIV AIDS. So that's the message to, to, the out, to the people out there. The 29-year-old artist also spoke about how he developed his love for art. Uh, I started art when I was at primary. I used to like doing cartoons from Potwek Malik, copying from Chronic newspaper. So he used to inspire me a lot. He held his first solo exhibition last year at the National Art Gallery. So I was sponsored by Hivos. So they to supply me with the material and also they f managed to, to make an exhibition which is as a solo, it was called Ekasi on one page. So Ekasi on one page, it was about the, the life of day-to-day -day life in high-density suburbs. His projects have attracted many art enthusiasts who frequently visit the gallery. I think he is a good artist especially on his uh, cultural drawings. Uh, one drawing which I saw, he had a good drawing. That was a good drawing. He had 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 a good drawing. Charlie urged upcoming artists to follow their dreams and to practice more if they want to make it in the industry. Reporting for ATV, Blawayo, Zimbabwe. A popular Chitungwiza dancing group, Ngoda Growth, is complaining about promoters who are shortchanging them when they perform. Muchaneta Chimuga reports. <laughs> Chikwata Shengoda Girls Dancing Group chino zivika nwa nembiri ya kutanda zavanu mumasho choche mmane kuchandira mafufu se gonzo. Paskana awavano tamba shunungisa mvura ase namo uru ndiyo ye kubiru wa neva rizive masho manu wavano fanira kunge vachiva tsigira. Notipa masho unazika ma promoters haya wanu kuna tatu zina zina hotifaya 
pamari ati takataura naye haizobudaye pamunopo hafu vamuonde vanoti tisa mari yaye vanoti tisa vasade kubadara vampamuonya tsonoti basara aita zvakanaka asi vanhu vainda se vanhu vanhu munhu acho vanhu vatisa patambi ava vanhu vane muri nokudaro vanenge vachitarisira huku wana choviri mushure mebasara vo rekutamba iri kore gyozi guru prakanaka rino tibatsira pane zvakawandisa rino isa kuti chichengetedze vabereki vedu Nicho ti isusu neso tichengetedzekewo ende tichienda kuzvimbo dzakawandisa mubasa rekutamba iri vasikana ava vanombunyikidzwa apo pavana sangana neveruzhinji kwakagumwone munhu haufana kutuka munhu because ndo ma audience nyani amdo ma supporters enyani ngachi kusapota saka kungotedzira kungofara zvinhu zvanenga ngoita haufana kumtuka mumwe wevatambi ava anokurudzira veruzhinji kuti vavatambire mubasa ravo saka vana vanyatsodzwisisa nyenyedzi nyaya dzemadance group idzi Anofungwa kuti munhu akapira kada vaenda pa dance group achita mamaba vameba anenge vadaita zvechipambi kana zvechika kana zvechi a a asoti munhu anenge ari pabasa zvakanakira kuti sese dance group yedu isusuka yakanakira kuti tinove tinori kwa host one tinopfeka zvinhu zvakafanana zvoti kwato unokora kuti ndinoni ndinofungwa kuti haruna mumwe wangu mutungamiri wechikwata ichi anotsanangura nezvekukosha kwechikwata ichi mukusimudzira hupenyu hwevasikana ava pese paninge tichanda kuti nokwanisa kunge tichirara mo Zvekuti hauchai utenga chikafu kuti uwane hembe dzekupfeka nekuitira mhuri nekuchengeta vabereki izvo kuti zvinhu zvanogara takawana mukura anoita hauti kwanza hukuwana zvimwe zvihombe zvihombe zviaizvo anotsana ngura zvekare nekutanga kwakaita chikwata ichi chinova chiri kugara muruseva rwekaseke yakatanga ndofunga yani yani almost 6 years ichi tatanga dance group yoi takaitanga vane chinangwa chekuti kuti vane kurarama Batsigiri vebasa iri vanopawo mashoko echenjezo kuvatambi ava We also advise these artists to have contracts to sign contracts with these people who buy their works because um, when they you want to take a legal action at least they have evidence Ndine mutori wena we ATV ndiri muchitungwisa Zimbabwe a group of high school teenagers calling themselves Angels Kingdom are set to release two music albums later this year. Eunice Feridai reports. I'm a little bit cynical to the point, but it's almost spiritual. A Bulawayo high school hip hop group is set to release two new albums later this year, breaking new ground on the musical scene. The trio started off as solo artists, and last year they formed a group called Angels Kingdom. Okay, basically, we write our own lyrics. And our gender is hip hop, R and B, and pop. You know, that's the thing that we do, man. The group started last year in July when I met Trevor through some friends. Uh, Trevor was doing his own thing, I was doing mine. And I went back to him and just told him, Trevor, let's start a group. But we didn't have a name by that time. So when I was writing some lyrics at home, I came up with the name Angels Kingdom. Went back to Trevor, told him he thought it was dope. The group, which is mainly into hip hop, sings about life, love, and other contemporary issues affecting teenagers. Well, basically, Angels Kingdom is a game. The message that we bring in our music is love, and you know, the teenage life. You get what I'm saying? The young artists also look up to international musicians for inspiration. Uh, for me, uh, I look up to Young Jeezy and uh, A Sword, and I like him. Uh, my friend Pearson looks up to Drake. We all like different things. And Trevor here looks up to J. Cole, you know. The teenagers say they were managing to balance between schoolwork and music. Um, I am Yunis Ferez, I reposing for ATV in Bulawa, your Zimbabwe. Thank you for joining us. Good night.